Hello everybody, welcome back to Jared Takes the L. Welcome back to another week here on the channel, and I finally am playing a game that I've been wanting to play for quite a long time. Just got it for Christmas, and boy, I am ready to go. We are finally playing Splatoon 3. Um, as you know, I've played Splatoon 2 on the channel quite a few times. I love the Splatoon games. Um, I played Splatoon 1 all the time on the Wii U, played Splatoon 2 all the time, and now we're finally on Splatoon 3. Now, I was debating, like, how did I want to do this, because all week is going to be Splatoon 3. I'm thinking what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to spend the first three days of the week uh, playing through the um, story mode of the game, and then the last two days, uh, Thursday, Friday, playing the online multiplayer mode. Um, that's that's kind of what I'm thinking of doing, just because I know the story mode's going to be longer, so I feel like that would be a good idea. Um, but we're going to hop in here. Oh. Oh, nice. Oh, of course, we're going to have the new uh, hosts of the show here. Not the Squid Sisters, that was Callie and Marie. Big Man. Who's Big Man? Is that Big Man? Like the Stingray or whatever back there? That's Shiver. Fry. Okay, Fry is the yellow. Okay. So you lip sync, we drip ink, I, I, I. <laughs> Let's see the current battle stages. Drum roll. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da Bam. Okay, Turf War, of course. Anarchy battle. Oh. I'm honestly not sure what Anarchy battle is, but that sounds kind of cool. Oh, and of course we got the... Uh, Salmon Run is still here. I didn't know Salmon Run was still here. Dude, I forgot about Salmon Run. Um, I think, I, I think I'm kind of starting to change my mind. What's that? Great Zapfish missing. This must be the story mode. Okay. The cool 90 degrees Fahrenheit. <laughs> okay. And that's it for now. Ooh, spicy. From Splatsville, that's a wrap. <laughs> Alright, and here we are. Welcome to Splatsville. Yeah, I had to go through a whole tutorial, you know, at the beginning of the game. Um, if you want to make it in this town, you got to be your freshest. And how do you show off your extremely fresh self? Online battles. Just hit up the lobby. Seriously, if you start making waves and battles, everyone around here will know your name. Wait, what? You're new here, and I don't mean to alarm you, but that dude is seriously scoping you from the sewer. Whatever, it's fishy, but we'll get to that later. So where were we? Alright, battles. Time to sink into the ink. If you want to get right to it, check out the lobby, or follow that weirdo down the sewer. Up to you. Go get him. Full splat ahead. Okay, so I forgot that... Oh yeah, and also tilt controls. Is there any way to change that, or is that literally the only way you can do this? Oh, you can turn motion controls off. Oh, thank goodness. Okay. I, I'm i honestly just not a big fan of, like... Okay, this is much better. <laughs> this feels a lot better. Here's Salmon Run. Can you go in? Oh, you can. So Salmon Run is not limited anymore. Like, I don't think you have to... Oh. Uh... What? Oh, you have to get to level four. Okay. Oh, I really, I really, really want to play Salmon Run before the week. For the splat cast. Oh, that's cool. Oh, this is actually really, really cool. I love this a lot. Oh, what do I want to do? So now I'm honestly not sure what I want to do. Do I want to do the story mode first? Do I want to do battles first? I think what I'm going to do... Okay, I I'm thinking. What I want to do is I want to do the um, story mode first. We'll do, like, a couple rounds of that um, today and tomorrow. And then Wednesday, we will start uh, the online battles. So Wednesday, Thursday, we'll do online. If I get to level 4, we'll do Salmon Run. If not... We'll have to come back when I get to level 4. Oh, wow. Is that the Eiffel Tower? What? Well...
Yeah. Octarians are coming. Again. <laughs> Anyhow, the name's Cuttlefish, senior advisor to the new Squid Beak Splatoon at your service. That look in your eye, it's the look I've been looking for. The great sap fish that powers Splatsville has been squidnapped. It's the Octarians again. You can bet your bottom sand dollar on it. See, the great zap fish has been missing before. Twice, in fact. And those octo jerks were behind it both times. I've been keeping an eye on them even though I'm technically retired. And with eyes like these, there ain't that much that escapes me. But they still made off with the great zap fish. And now we've got to get it back, right? So, uh... That was a job offer, kid. The pay is zero, but you might just save the world. You're in, right? Right? Of course you are. Starting today, you are Agent 3 of the new Squid Beaks Platoon. This is your brand new hero suit. It'll help you fight the Octarians. Huh, is there such a thing as something growing in the wash? It's a little baggy on you. Funny, I don't remember ever washing it. Bah, that last Agent 3 was clean as a catfish. Now let's go get those Octa Octo Clowns. I'm counting on you, Buck. Oh! You've already got another agent there with you, huh? Well, I'm fresh out of hero suits, unfortunately. Ah, but well, it's a salty little scamp, ain't it? It'll do fine. Now, where was I? Oh, right. Let's go get those Octo Jerks. I'm counting on you, bucko. Oh, man, this is great. So, I don't think I ever actually played the Story Mode of Splatoon 2. I played the Octo Expansion. That was on the channel once. Um, and yeah, alright. So, where do I go exactly? Just this way? Mind the fuzzy ooze all over the place. Touch that stuff and who knows what'll happen. What is that instant full body? Oh! That was not fun. <laughs> okay. Let's not do that again. I like having this little this little buddy with me. He's, he's cute. These guys were enemies in Salmon Run in the last game, I remember that. Oh. There's one big pile of fuzzy ooze. That big old bubble on top is probably the fuzzball. I bet if you could pop that, the whole thing would poof, disappear, but I doubt your ink will do the trick. Eh, let's worry about that later. For now, keep looking for a way into the Octarian's base. Oof, this whole place could use a shave or a shower or whatever cleans up fuzzy ooze. Old ink isn't doing much. We got anything with more oomph? Oh, probably a bomb. Oh, I need to throw you at it. How do I throw a bomb? Wait, how do I throw a bomb? I didn't do anything. Um, I don't have any other weapons. Oh, over here, I'm stupid. Is our first level? Okay. I was just not thinking straight, apparently. <laughs> I I'm good now. Alright, Octarians in the crater, yikes. This is much better than using tilt controls, honestly. Well, honestly, Splatoon on the Wii would have been a good thing, since that was like all motion controls now. Goodbye. Um. Okay. There's a lot of uh, a lot of places we can go. What's this? Oh, nice. Okay. Uh, which way do I want to go? Though there's quite a few paths. 
I guess it doesn't really matter. Oh. Octo Trooper ahead. It's a real life enemy. Get ready to splat it with ZR Agent 3. Alright. Hey, it's a zapfish. Nice. <laughs> okay. I guess that. Okay, cool. So I guess that's how you win the levels. You have to save the zapfishes. Well, at age of three, you remind me of a young cuttlefish heroically saving the day. Anyway, the good news is that you got a zapfish, they're a source of energy on their own. But the better news is that the great zapfish may be up ahead. Okay. Oh, right, I plumb forgot about all this fuzzy ooze. And that blasted fuzzball is just wobbling back and forth, taunting us. Is that your small fry buddy chirping about something? Yo, yeah, that species is rumored to have a big reaction to power eggs. Why don't you toss a few of them to the little scamp? Anything's worth a shot, right? Try pressing the right stick to power up your little buddy. Oh, what? This is crazy. Wow, it gobbled up the ooze like it was nothing. That little monster is quite an appetite. Anyway, it cleared the path for you. Go on. That's awesome. I love having this little buddy. Okay, this looks like our next level down here. I wonder why you have to go into kettles. I always found that to be kind of strange. <laughs> like, it doesn't really make any sense, but I mean, what do I know? Alright, let's do this thing. Oh, there's already some ink here. I gotta get all these. I, I have a feeling I have to get all these power eggs. Jump through the onion rings. <laughs> oh, dash tracks. Yes, I remember these. Woo! Shoot. Alright, I guess I gotta try to go back up there. The music is always so strange in these games, but it's so good. The games are always just amazing. Has that already been done? I was already down here. What, do you mean? what? What are you talking about? I thought that was the way I had to go. Oh, 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 okay. Sorry. I see now. Oh! Jeez. Got it. <laughs> That's so funny. Oh, man. 
This game is amazing so far. Nicely done, Agent 3. But did those Octarians look different? They used to be a little more smooth, if memory serves. I ain't one to judge a deadly tentacle creature by its cover. More power to him, uh, but not really. Anyhow, as long as you're sporting that hero suit, you can stand up to any Octarian, bearded or not. Did you even read the label? Here, I'll do it for you. You're wearing the latest in apocalyptic survival fashion. Avoid enemies and navigate the Splatlands in style with your own high-end sensor. Dry clean only. You gotta learn everything about your gear. That's another battle-tested rule of the battlefield. You can cover him with ink. That's amazing. Um, oh, up there. I see. What is that? Oh, it's a decoration. Okay. A loot anchor. Oh, great. They got loot boxes now in this game. <laughs> Just what I needed. Full step could send me over the edge, huh? Whoa, okay. This is crazy. Gotta aim this right. There we go. There we go, there's our next level. I do one more today. It'll be this one. I don't remember, I didn't even see what it was called. Did anyone else see what it was called? Boxes locked. Keys, please. Oh, great. So there's gonna be a key in one of these boxes, basically. Oh, right there. Do you remember these? There we go. Checkpoint already? That was fast. Where's that key? No? Where the... Small fries? Oh, I see. Oh, that's so cool. So that's what he does. Small fry is awesome. Oh, we got the key. Okay, so we finally got this. Oh, we need another key? over here. Well, there's a locked box over here, too. There's locked boxes everywhere. Um, let's see. Oh, there's one key. Which key does this open? This one? Okay. That takes me back over here. I need I still need to find the key to that one. Um Oh, it's probably up there. How do I get up there? How am I gonna get up here? Oh right there, I see it. I see it, but how in the world am I supposed to get there? Jump for it? No, bad idea. 
How do I get up there? Um. Uh. You can't climb up anything there. Genuinely kind of curious about this. Nowhere else to really go. What is that? No. How do you get on it though? There's gotta be another way to get up there, I just know there is. Okay, obviously can't go down there. Is there one over there? Let me go back over here. Is there anything over here? No, okay. Good to know. It's not this. I'm genuinely not sure. <laughs> oh, 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 I got it, I got it, I got it. Oh wait, but I don't want to be up there. I gotta go back this way. Oh, that took me way too long to figure out. Finally. <laughs> Alright, we finally did it. Finally completed that level. Perfect. Keep it up, Agent 3, you're making me proud. Now, I don't want to ruffle your tentacles any further than they've already been ruffled, but those fuzzy Octarians are freaking me out. I think we ought to consider calling some backup. Let me just fire up the old communicator. Check, check, this is Cuttlefish over. Do you copy? Agent 2 here, over. Wait, Gramps, is that you? Where are you? Oh, yeah, it's Marie. Agent 1, this is Agent 2. Gramps has wandered off again, over. Well, what are we waiting for, Agent 2? Let's go collect him. Roger that, stay fresh. Did they just hang up on me? Agents these days, am I right? So impatient. Shh, shh. Uh, cuddle, I found you? Dagnabbit, this whole thing is busted. Oh well, come on, let's go. Hmm, that sounded a little creepy. Alright, well I completed that one. I guess that's going to do it for today, guys. When we come back tomorrow, we're going to continue playing more of the story mode, which is actually really, really fun so far. I'm really liking this story mode. Um, but yeah, I guess that's going to do it for today. Maybe I am going to do two more episodes on this, then we'll just do two of the online multiplayers, and then I'll have the Salmon Run thing kind of be a cliffhanger, uh, which we'll do at a later point. Um, but yeah, that's going to do it for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out, everybody.